as part of our continuing research into alternative uses for pickled vegetables, there's one question that's been on everybody's lips, and that is, could you use a gherkin to ignite a hydrogen and oxygen balloon? Well, valid question, but there's only one way to find out. Right, so here's the fuse that we've actually come up with. It's a rubber bung which fits into the base of the balloon. This is a two foot round balloon, so it's quite big. We've got two wires that go through the bung, one connected to the live and one connected to the neutral because we're gonna use mains AC current to uh, set this thing off. And one of the wires, the neutral, goes in the base of the gherkin, the live wraps around the top and also pierces the gherkin. But the, the wires themselves aren't touching inside the gherkin. We're relying on the gherkin itself to provide the conductive path for the current. Um, and then this tube here is just our gas inlet for filling the balloon. So here we are. Um, We've added the balloon, taped it uh, safely in position around the bung so it's not going to pop off. Um, and the gherkin is inside the balloon. This, this does look somehow wrong. Uh, but anyway, let's go fill it up with some hydrogen and oxygen. Right, here we go. We're out at the Wonderstruck test facility, just about ready to set it off. Now, I've just realized we've actually put the mixture in wrong. We've put uh, two parts oxygen to one part hydrogen because we put the oxygen in first and we usually put the hydrogen in first. So it's not actually gonna be as loud as it should be, but it should still detonate. If I've got enough gas left, uh, we'll do it again with the proper mixture. Five, four, three, two, one. Well, I think that was still quite loud, but let's do it again anyway. Well, that was a bit louder, but you'll have to take our word for it because we filmed it in our rather limited slow-mo capacity. Um, but there you go, that's the answer to our question. Yes, you can use a gherkin to ignite a hydrogen and oxygen balloon. And you know, we can't help thinking that no one else in the world may have ever done that before. If you do know of anyone who's done it, let us know, because we'd be interested to find out. So, hope you enjoyed it, and don't forget to follow us on Facebook, we're Wonderstruck Wow there as well, and Twitter, where we're also Wonderstruck Wow. <laughs>